Before we start this video, I want to test your still game knowledge, so without using Google or checking the other comments, can you tell me which still game character's name was written wrong in the credits of every single episode in season 1, 2 and 3? Bonus points if you can tell me the name that was written instead. Still game. Quite simply, one of the best TV comedies ever created. I don't care what anybody says, nothing was more relatable and real than Still Game. The, the, the last two seasons were maybe a wee bit pish, but I'm chalking that up as a mere bump on the comedy road. I mean, we've had 56 episodes split across 8 seasons, we're bound to have a few shiters along the way. Anyway, the new series drops this Sunday night, and I have to tell you, I'm buzzing for it. Y you might even say, I'm still game for it. <laughs> no. No. Also, no, this isn't a paid promotion. Fucking wish it was though. The main thing with Still Game is that so many folk have seen it and it's become such a big part of the culture of this country that everybody knows a lot about it. Or at least they think they do. So I want to put that knowledge to the test. As you know, I launched a new merch site over at batchy.co.uk and I want to give away one of my new Get Out My House or Grown Up Scottish t-shirts to the person that can prove to me that they have the most Still Game knowledge. I I'm not really sure how we're going to go about that since there is a lot of people that have seen it. So I'm thinking about hosting an open quiz night on the Create Scotland Discord server this Friday night. If you want to take part in the open quiz, come along, have a bit of fun, maybe win a free t-shirt, then make sure you check out the link to the Create Scotland Discord server linked in the description. Anyway, I've seen every single Still Game episode about 40 times, and I'm constantly dropping quotes and talking about things that happened, so I genuinely wanted to test my own knowledge on Still Game and see how much I really knew about it. So I sat down with my man Cruiser, and the two of us proceeded to start testing each other's knowledge on Still Game. Quick shout out to the notification squad. Badgie.co.uk for your merch. Have you been to Batchy.co.uk and picked up your no, merch? No, I'm getting a free one. <laughs> you fucking think so? This is the ballad of Mrs. Mrs. Big. Who she, now deep wins and dodgy I, leg. Now she, she waits on, on him around yeah. the clock because she got fond oh, of old Bert's cock. <laughs> so, like, you kind of look at the screen. Right. And I'll ask you a question about Still Game Power. Finish the quote. Finish the quote? Aye. That's tight. Tight. The first quote. When life hands you melons, Oh no. When life hands you melons, finish the quote. Melons, stick them up your ass. <laughs> what? Is that what you do with melons, is it? I don't know. When life hands you melons, you make melonade. Is that it? Aye. You never heard that then? Ho ho ho, it's the two Ronnies. Oh, f off. Ronnie Corbett and Ronnie Barker. Don't know who that is. How do you not know who the two Ronnies are? <laughs> who are they? Mate. Let me Over. see what they look like. Oh, I know that wee fella. Aye, Ronnie. That wee bottom fella. Ronnie, that wee, Ronnie Corbett and Ronnie Barker, the two Ronnies. At the end of every show, they used to say, it's goodbye from me and it's goodbye from him. So the comeback is, the two Ronnies is I. Well, it's shut up your prick for me and it's shut up your prick for him. And he can still game coach. A scone and tea at, at half, half past, past three. three. Makes your day a little brighter. So take your cakes and fancy tarts and stick them up your shiter. <laughs> <laughs> Good theory, Jack. Plausible. And it could have happened just like that. Were it not for the fact... Say it again. How do you not know this, man? Cause I don't remember them off by heart. I watch the episodes. I don't sit and go, right, let me take in every single bit of information they say. I don't know, what is it? That you are a greedy bastard. Ah. Uh, Good theory, okay. Jack. Plausible. And it could have happened just like that. Were it not for the fact that you are a greedy bastard. How do you know Ken that? Because I don't remember what I had cunt! Now when I sat down to do this with Cruiser, the one thing that I forgot is that he's a dafty. So I gave up testing him before I began repeatedly punching him in the scalp. And we began to combine our efforts on some of the online still game quizzes. Which, can I just say, are pretty bloody hard. Wait till we get around it. Right, just because you've seen them, you're remembering them. I'll remember them anyway. I know most of the quotes. How well do you know Still Game? Like, uh, we'd smash this, man. Yeah, we should smash this. Easy. And which fictional part of Glasgow does Still Game take place? <laughs> wish you all well. well. I wish you all well. I wish you all well. Or South what? Darnley South Darnleyville. Just get it to me. me. Aye, don't get too excited. That was an easy one. Shit. What's the name of the local pub masterfully ran by Bobby the Butter? Clansman. The Clansman, the Royal Oak, or the Pig in the Whistle? The Clansman. Correct. Pints are on you. Which course did Jack and Victor take night classes for? Whiskey tasting, physics, or medical proficiency? Medical proficiency. That is indeed the correct answer. To the top of the class, pal. I'm trying to imagine if a still game character was reading it. Did that come across? How much did Winston win at Stevie the Bookies before the shifty bookie did the off? Did the off. That's when he lost his, his leg butt, didn't he? Was it £32,500? £1 million um, pounds. What? Oh, my. Stop trying 32, to do jokes, 32, man. Just do the quiz. 32. 32 and a half grand. Who invented the beefy bait? Oh... Mr. Greggs, Alexander Keep the Graham Bell. It was a big thing about for 
for that pish. It was indeed. Treat yourself to a beefy bake at the earliest convenience. Aye. In the and live show, some. what flavour is Iza's homemade soup? Pea yes, and ham from yeah. chicken, mushroom or chicken and noodle. I remember an instant with pea and ham soup that involved Iza, so I'm guessing it's that. Oh, I pea and ham, sorry. But I might be wrong. No, for f- sake. Well, in, the well. live, in the live show, where does... I'll say Johannesburg. Because, no, in fact, no, because that's thing. He's that son. It's either Canada or Craig Lang. But Johannesburg is Canada. Aye, but... Right, so it's Craig Lang or Canada. So guessing Craig Lang. Aye, that's what I was thinking, aye. Right, you've not thought this through, have you? We're getting owned here. Sylvester McCoy appeared as a guest in Oot. What was the name of his character? That was uh, Archie. Archie. He's a... Uh, Correct. A hermit. You thought about clicking Doctor Who, didn't you? When he was a hermit. Aye. What was Tam's prize for winning the card game in Cairds? Uh, he's been my scooter. Joe's mobility scooter. Yup, the scoundrel. <laughs> no half room. The hardest still game trivia quiz you'll ever take. Oh, it's got a timer. Can oh, you what? pause it? Pause it. There's a pause button. Oh what? That's sack material. Oh, we've we'll been done. Absolute dirty sack here. material. Still, Still game was a spin-off. Does this see if I tune type, fat. Does that if I type this here? I'll do it instantly. Just do tune of fat. There you go. What does the Max. mat outside Jack's flat say? Wet well, well, what is wet What time? What time did Jack and Victor and Shug think Victor's son? Oh, half two. How did? Is it? Half two. Oh, half two. Four, four. <laughs> Of two and, and called. called. Who did Jack and Victor discover? Uh, McIntyre, Willie McIntyre. Willie Mac. Aye, was it Willie McIntosh or McIntyre? McIntosh, do McIntosh. Oh, it is. Willie McIntosh. Oh, wait. Oh, that was further down. <laughs> Who died and came back to life only to discover that his house had been robbed and things that were borrowed from other oh, people? Oh, that's. Willie McIntosh. So, what's his name? For- uh, we'll get to that in a second. Uh, what is the name of the pub Winston hasn't visited in 15 oh, years? Oh my oh god. Oh my god, this is when they end up getting the comes in dism. Uh, I've not been in here in 15 years. <laughs> right, see you in all 15 years. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what is that called? Sutton, we'll come back to it. Missy's bed catches <sighs> Winston dancing in the bookies because his horse won. Name the horse. Oh no. Wait, wait, wait. Scotch Corner. Oh, Scotch Corner. Scotch Corner. Scotch Corner. Uh, when discussing literally tastes. What? what? Literal. We're discussing literally tastes. Literal. With, literal. No, it's literary. Lit, it's literally. Literary. Literal. There's no L, it's a Y. Literally. Liter. Oh, patch it, patch it. Right. I know it too. How much does Tam pay Victor for the car? Five, it's 300. 300? 200? 300. Yeah. What is the name of the Ned's caddy? Oh, I because the wee Ned. Oh, I even know I. Oh, what is his name again? Right, Winston sinks a few quid into something from the cash and carry to expand his... Jack, Jack and Victor's, Victor's catering, catering business. business in the Veed shop. What is it? What? Wait, what? Winston sinks a right few quid into something. Oh, is that not when they start making the rolls and all that? Sausage rolls and stuff? So would it not be rolls. food? Food? Rolls and sausage. Mm. Sausage rolls. <sighs> what is How much does Stevie owe Winston when Winston's accumulator comes in? 32,000. 500. Oh, right. Oh, so... Where I'm... does Big Innes live? Oh, f- Mr. Maduri. Aye, uh, he's up, he's up north. Like, uh, he's Elgin up north or something. something. Elgin. Oh, right. Oh, mate, this gave Dennis a done. Look at the timer. What do Jack and Victor dress as for the fancy dress night of the part of the clansmen? Fancy dress night. Uh, oh, they oh, dress oh, as they... each other? Aye. Uh, aye, uh, we go. What it? business does Tam claim to be in when in... Oh, eh... Uh, uh, beetroot. No, beetroot. Beetroot's Jack and Victor. Uh, he, no, he's first. Oh, it is. Alright. What did Pete the JK invent? Uh, steak bake. Beefy bake. Beefy, beefy bake. Let's get one more in. Come on. Oh, we just got out in time. But I'm not getting yet because you're out of time. Scotch corn, Scotch corn, Scotch corn, Scotch corn. Anyway, that's about all the time we have for in today's video. If you enjoyed it, please make sure to drop a like and consider subscribing to the channel if you're new. Make sure you check out the link to the Create Scotland Discord server to take part in the Still Game Quiz, and also check out the link to my merch, which you can find down in the description. You could subscribe to Cruiser as well, I suppose, but if you're going to do that, at least go over to his newest video and comment telling him that he needs to get a bloody haircut. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video. I'm creeping.